Hello, hello. Hello. Hello, guys. How are you? How are you guys? How was your weekend? Nice, nice. Okay, we're gonna start with our session for today. Today is September the 25th. Miren, ya casi estamos abordando otra semanita más y ya casi terminamos. Hemos avanzado bastante hasta el día de hoy. María Fernanda, hello, Mari. María Fernanda. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine. I'm fine. Okay, good. Let's see. How about the rest? ¿Cómo están los demás? ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? ¿Descansaron? ¿Dormieron? ¿Trabajaron mucho? Dormimos mucho. So you slept a lot. Okay, yeah, that's great. Okay, so I'm gonna start sharing in a minute. Let me see. Some hands and throws. So today is our session 14, guys. For today's lesson, we're gonna be talking about some prepositions. And besides that, we're gonna be talking about the time, right? The time, how to say the time in English. Hello, Adriana. Uh, Walter, what are you doing, Walter? What is that at the back? Yeah, but I the am dying here. Sorry. <laughs> I just saw little <laughs> lies at the back. <laughs> no, it's a background. Yeah, I know, but I didn't <laughs> <know>. uh, <laughs> <laughs> David, hello, David. Oh, my goodness. Let me stay with the date. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Uh, we're going to start, guys, with our session. And look at this. Here we have our class objective. Can you read that, please? David, David, help us, David. David, can you read the class objective? Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello, Sergio. Hi, Sergio. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Nice. Read. Yeah, please, Sergio, help us. Uh, participants will be able to answer questions about some, someone else, days, and times. Or workplace activities. Okay, excellent. So we're gonna start checking this. Um, answer questions about someone else's deeds in times, mm -hmm. workplace activities. Okay, let's see. So look at this. We're gonna have warming up a top task, a task, and we're gonna have some conversations. So this is our session for team. Okay. So, for example, we're going to start with some uh, vocabulary. Summer, spring, winter, and autumn. So, do you know what are these? ¿Alguien sabe qué son, qué son, esos, qué son estas palabras que tenemos acá? What is that? Summer. Las estaciones. Las estaciones. Ah, yeah, right, las estaciones. Summer, what is summer? The easy eh, Verano. Spring. Verano. Eh, nieve, no. 
spring, no, spring. Primavera. Primavera. Do we have spring here in El Salvador? No. No. Que no existe. Okay, winter. And uh, what is winter? Winter. Invierno. And autumn. Otoño. Otoño. Okay, excellent. Midday and midnight. What is that? So we have opposite words. Midday. What is midday? Mediodía. Mediodía. And how about midnight? Medianoche. La medianoche. Time, date. What is a date? Cita. Teacher. Una cita o una fecha. Sí, dígame. Eh, no, no es también mediodía. También, ya, yeah, también. Así okay. tenemos. Midday es otra forma. Así que puede ser ah. no también. Ok, ya. Yeah. Week, month, and year. Y también tenemos aquí eh, todo relacionado con fechas. ¿verdad? Con fechas, estaciones del año. So, let's see. Um, ok, so we're going to start with this part. Ok. We're going to be talking about... Es que estaba, a... estaba bien mal. Okay, vamos a ver. Empezamos por ahí, chicos, con eh, las fechas. How to ask the time in English? What are the questions that we normally use when we want to talk about time? Let's see. And we're going to be having an, an activity later on. So asking the time. How do we ask the time? ¿Cómo, cómo pedimos la hora? ¿Cómo, la, ¿Cómo preguntamos? ¿Qué preguntas debemos hacer? So look at this. We can use some questions for asking the time, which are given below questions. Number one, Vanessa, can you help us reading that? What, uh -huh, number one. What time is it? Uh -huh, what time is it? Listen, what time is it? What time is it? What time is it? What, <coughs> what time is it? Mm -hmm, what time is it? <coughs> what is the time? What is the time? What is the what, time? What is the time? Uh-huh. Do you have that time? Time. Do you have that time? Tienes la hora. Or do you know what time is it? Sabes? Usted sabe qué hora es? Can you tell me what time is it, please? So you're getting kind of, uh, let's say, more formal, right? So could you tell me that time, please? So you can use can or even could. So, And then you add the word, please. Do you happen to have the time? Okay. Have you got the right time? Tienes la hora exacta? What time do you make it? <laughs> so all of these questions are in order to get the time. De casualidad, tiene la hora? So do you happen to have the time? Or what time do you make it? Okay, what else tiene? Let's see. Um, how to answer to these questions? Vamos empezando uh, desde el principio. Cómo preguntar la hora y después vamos viendo, desarrollando cómo, cómo se dice. So in order to answer these questions, how do we say the time? Look at these examples. It's exactly or about or almost or just gone. For example, it's exactly eight o'clock. Exactamente las ocho en punto. O cerca de o sobre. Or it's about eight o'clock. Okay, sobre las ocho. Almost eight. It's almost eight, casi las ocho, okay? And just gone means se ha ido. For example, past the part of the, the time. Let's see, sure, it is. Mira, tenemos algunas palabras que podemos ir utilizando. Seguro, it is three o'clock. Sorry, I'm not wearing a watch. Lo siento, no estoy usando o no llevo un reloj. Uh, another way could be saying just the time, 2.30. Otra forma también, solamente decir el número. It is 4.20 or 20 past 4. It's 10. It is 10 past 10. The time is 8 o'clock. Entonces, esas son, son algunas ideas. Let's see. So, let's repeat the question. Let's repeat the question and later we're going to focus on how to answer these questions. Listen, listen and repeat that with me. What time is it? What, what time, time is it? What is the time? What is the time? What is the time? What is the time? Do you have the time? Do you have, Do you have the time? Do you know what time is it? Do you know what time is it? No, no, no. Do you know what time is it? Do you know what time is it? 
is it? Do you do you know what time is it? Is it? Is it? Is, is it? Uh -huh, is it? Yeah, we kind of joined our words. Is it? Is it? Okay. Can you tell me what time is it, please? Can you tell me what time is it, please? Can you tell me what time is it? Tell me what time is it, please. Mm -hmm. Okay. Could you tell me the time, please? Could you tell me the time, please? Could you tell me the time, please? Okay. Okay, so uh, focus on this. Could, could, could you tell me the time, please? Could, could without L, sin, sin la L. So, like, just say, could, could you tell me the time, please? Could you could tell, you tell me, me the time, please? Me the could, could. Tell me. Something like this, could. Could you tell me the time, please? Could, could you, could tell, you me tell me the time, time please? Could, could, listen, could. Could, could. Could. Yeah, could. Could, could you tell me the time, please? So without could pronouncing L, sin pronunciar la, la L, could you tell me the time, please? And, could you tell me the time, please? Okay. Next, do you happen to have the time? Do you happen to have the time? Do you happen, do you to, happen have to have the time? Do you happen to have the time? Mm -hmm. Y con contestaríamos, sure, it is three, for example. Seguro, son las tres, right? Do you happen to have the time? Do you happen to have, have, the, time? To have the time? Have you got the right time? How do you got the right, the right time? time? Right. Have you got the right time? Right time. Have you got have the, you right, got time? the right, time? right time? Okay, let's see. Um, What time do you make it? What time do you make it? What time, what time do, you make, do it? you make it? What make time it? do you make it? Okay, so what time do you make it? Let's see. So now let's check the examples of how to answer. It's exactly. It's exactly. It's exactly. Okay. It's about. What about? It's about. about. Ajá, acá, yo lo voy separando. It's exactly, entonces, exactamente son las tres, por ejemplo. O oh, sobre, it's about three. Okay, sobre las tres. Okay. Ahora, la otra que, entonces ahí ese or les va diciendo, puede ser it's exactly, oh. o puede ser about, o puede ser almost. Entonces, la primera, exactamente, la segunda, sobre, y la tercera, casi. Ajá, or just gone. Oh, yes, for example, um, or it's, uh, let's say, um, son cuatro probably, los minutos o la hora que se ha ido, just gone, three o'clock, right? What's gone? ¿Qué significa? Mm, por ejemplo, cuando se refiere a los minutos, las horas que han pasado, okay? Ido, ahí significa ido, el gone, o sea, han ido, so, ido. Okay, the next one is sure it is three. Sure it is three. <laughs> um, it is uh -huh. three. Sure it is three. Sure it is three. Three o'clock. Three o'clock. Entonces, cuando son horas exactas, yeah. vamos poniendo o'clock. No son horas exactas. Sorry, I am not wearing a watch. Sorry, I'm Sorry, not wearing a watch. Sorry, I am not wearing a watch. I am not wearing a watch. <laughs> No lo uso porque no me la puedo tampoco. <ríe> Maybe, I don't know, no le ha pasado. Tienen, no, no sé, no sé, ¿cómo se llaman con los relojes análogos? <ríe> ¿Qué es eso? Maybe. Sí, no. Nowadays we use cell phones, right? Ahora usamos teléfonos. Ya, yeah, por el 2015 estaban de moda. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you sure? Let's see. Uh, 230. 2.30, so that's another possibility. Y vamos a estar viendo aquí cómo, cómo se va leyendo también. Eso es una forma. It is 4.20. It is 4.20. It is 10 past 10. Miren, ha pasado 10 minutos después de las 10. Or the time is 8 o'clock. Entonces, estas son algunas ideas de cómo podemos contestar a estas preguntas. Let's see. So now, let's check the, um, the clock. Entonces, vemos ahí el reloj. Para irnos guiando cómo vamos a decir la hora. Entonces, pero parece que comentamos algo de esto en um, clase anterior. ¿no? Hoy lo vamos a ver un poquito más detallado. So, at uh, other hours, we're going to use the words pass and to. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que vamos a hacer acá? Tenemos nuestro reloj. Entonces, from 12 to 6. ¿eh? 
Hola. Vamos a utilizar pass for minute 1 to 30 minutes. Entonces, de los minutos del 1 al 30, es decir, de acá hasta acá, vamos a utilizar la palabra pass. Desde acá, desde las 6, que okay, desde el minuto 31 hasta acá, las 59, utilizamos la palabra to. Entonces, ¿por qué? Porque acá, de este lado, de este lado del reloj, We're gonna mention the minutes that have passed. Vamos a mencionar los minutos que han pasado después de una hora. Por ejemplo, los minutos que han pasado después de las 11, de las 10, de las 9, de las 3, de las 4. Entonces, de cualquier hora. Entonces, pero desde acá hasta acá, utilizamos la palabra pass. De acá a acá, to. Para mencionar los minutos que faltan para la siguiente hora. Ahora, tenemos otro dato curioso acá. O'clock. ¿Cuándo utilizamos o'clock? Ya vimos anteriormente, mencionábamos algo. ¿Para horas? Cuando las horas cuando son exacto. redondas. Ajá, cuando es una hora exacta. Por ejemplo, it's 12 o'clock, it's 1 o'clock, it's 2 o'clock, it's 3 o'clock. Ahora, ¿qué pasa con los? No? Vamos a irlo desglosando poquito a poquito. Veamos acá la información que tenemos. Um, for of the answer, it is... Miren, mencionamos acá los minutos que han pasado o mencionamos los minutos que faltan para la siguiente hora. ¿Cómo así? Veamos el ejemplo acá. It is four minutes to eight. ¿Cuántos minutos faltan para las ocho? Vean acá el ejemplo ustedes. Acá. Acá. Cuatro minutos para... Ajá. ¿Para qué? Miren, las, it's 7.56, las 7.56. Entonces, ¿cuántos oh, minutos? Cuatro a las ocho. Exacto, cuatro oh, minutos oh, para las ocho. Y también tenemos la otra forma. It is 7.56, leerlo de la manera como, eh, pues, mencionando la hora y luego los minutos. Entonces, es menos no. formal, pero es posible. ¿Ok? Entonces, puede ser cualquiera de estas dos. It is four minutes to eight. Cuatro en minutos. Inglés, en inglés siempre es así. Como uno en español a veces dice, ah, fa, la una y, y 58, dijo. La una y 58. Dos para dos, uh -huh. Ajá, sí, dos para es exactamente lo, lo mismo. Entonces aquí estamos Ajá. mencionando cuatro minutos para las ocho. Lo único que tenemos que manejar es esto. ¿verdad? ¿Dónde voy a utilizar las palabras pass y dónde utilizo el, el to? Entonces este, decíamos acá. Desde el minuto 1 hasta el 30, llegamos, utilizamos past. 31 hasta el 59, utilizamos to. Pero cada uno indica algo diferente, ¿verdad? Y los minutos que han pasado después de una hora, y aquí los que faltan para la siguiente hora. Entonces ahí es donde no hay que confundirse, ¿verdad? Porque tiende a confundir. Vale, veamos ahí el otro ejemplo. It is seven minutes past 11. What time is it? It is seven minutes past 11. Miren. It is seven minutes past 11. ¿Cuántos minutos han pasado después de las 7? A mí, ¿no? Perdón, de las 11. 7. 7, ajá. 7 minutes. Less formal, it's 11.07. También podemos ir utilizando, por ejemplo, los minutos del 1 al 9. Del, sí, del 1 al 9. Vamos ubicando un 0, ¿verdad? Entonces, um, it's 11.07, las 11, 0, 7. Entonces, este O is pronounced like the letter O, no zero. Entonces, este es un O que vamos ubicando ahí también. Para mencionar esos, ese rango de minutos. It's 11.07, it's 11.05, it's 11.06. Entonces, este 0 se pronuncia como una O, eso es lo que quiere decir ahí, no cero. Entonces no digo it's 1107, no, it's 1107, it's 1103, it's 1105, it's 1108. Okay. Uh, another example that we have, it is nine minutes to three. ¿Cuántos minutos faltan para la siguiente hora? Nueve. Ajá. Uh -huh. Nine, nine. Nueve para las tres. So this is less formal. It is 51. Entonces tenemos la otra forma que es 
Uh, it is 51. 51. It is, ah, aquí, aquí se comieron ahí. ¿Cuál sería la otra forma? It is 2. 50, 50, 51. Las dos. Las dos y cuánto? 51. 251. Cualquier forma de esa está bien. Sí, aunque usualmente usamos esta, la primera, utilizando pass, utilizando to, pero se puede utilizar esta también. Y también la otra diferencia es que una forma es la británica y la otra es la americana. But it, this is considered to be less formal, this one. Yes. Well, so that's up to you, right? Let's see. So now let's check. Um, we have some more examples to check. And we're going to be uh, checking that one by one. Vamos a ir viendo ejemplos para que se le vaya quedando un poco más clara la idea. Full hours or o'clock, right? What is exact? A clock is used at full hours. It means there are no minutes. That means that there is no minute marked. So, not exact. Uh, form of the answer. It is. And then you add the number. So, look, for the exact number, we put the number. It is 10 o'clock. Can you read the next examples, Maria Fernanda? Examples. It is. It is 11 o'clock. It, it is three o'clock. It is five o'clock. Okay. And uh, can you continue, Sergio? Note in English time. Time, um, note. Mm -hmm. no, note. In English, time express with uh, 11 hour time zones. Mm -hmm. With 12 hour time zones. So what do we mean? Eso quiere decir que con, en inglés la hora o el tiempo es expresado con um, usualmente un horario de 12 horas, ¿verdad? No un horario militar. Is, um, so it means from 1 to 12, right? Well. We have the time. So we have a formal form and then you have a less formal way to say that the formas it is remember you're going to be using verb to be para decir la hora siempre vamos utilizando el verbo to be it is it is mm -hmm. or it's or la contracción it's okay so maybe it sounds easy but i know it's kind of hard when it comes to say it okay does it se ve? uh yeah it looks so easy right se ve, se ve bien fácil but you have to uh, learn how to say it, okay? So it's, so you normally use it's the contraction, it's one o'clock, it's two o'clock, it's three o'clock, it's four o'clock, it's five o'clock, it's six o'clock, it's seven o'clock, it's eight o'clock, it's nine o'clock, it's 10 o'clock, it's 11 o'clock, or it's 12 o'clock. Let's see, so now let's practice that together. So listen and repeat that with me. It's one o'clock. It's one o'clock. It's two o'clock. It's three o'clock. It's three o'clock. It's three o'clock. Three, 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 three. Three, 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 three. Three, 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 three. Están diciendo mm -hmm. la, la hora, el número tres. Three, three, three o'clock. Three, three o'clock. It's four o'clock. Four o'clock. Four o'clock. It's five o'clock. It's six o'clock. Six. Six. It's seven o'clock. It's seven o'clock. It's eight o'clock. It's, it's eight o'clock. It's nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock. Ten o'clock. It's ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Twelve. Twelve o'clock. Okay, so now let's repeat that again. It's one o'clock. It's one o'clock. Two o'clock. It's three o'clock. It's three o'clock. Four o'clock. 
It's four o'clock. It's five o'clock. It's five o'clock. Okay. It's six. It's six o'clock. Six. Okay. It's six o'clock. Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Six. Six. Like this. Okay. Six. It's six. It's six. Okay. It's six o'clock. It's seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Eight o'clock. It's eight. Eight o'clock. Nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Ten o'clock. Nine o'clock. Ten o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. Eleven. 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 Listen. Eleven. Okay. Eleven. 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 Solamente que dicen ahí corta. Okay. Eleven. Eleven. No van a decir eleven. No. Eleven. 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 It's eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. Okay. It's twelve. Twelve. It's twelve. 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 It's twelve o'clock. It's twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock. It's twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Okay, nice. So now we continue with the next part. Is it clear so far? Bon bien fait. Yes. yes. <laughs> so it, it's it's like a baby's class. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> We're learning baby. about the time. No, I'm just kidding. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. At a, a quarter hours, meaning con los cuarto de hora, so 15 minutes after the hour or 15 minutes before the hour. Entonces, ¿cómo vamos a contar esos cuartos? 15 minutos después de una hora o 15 minutos antes de la siguiente o la próxima hora. A quarter to in a quarter past expressions are used when clock shows quarter hours. Entonces, la utilizamos para mostrar cuartos. Entonces, puede ser a quarter to, un cuarto para... O un cuarto pasada, una hora. ¿Ya? Yeah? Okay. So now, let's check the following examples. It is, uh, no sé si se ve ahí lo que está en rojito abajo, forms of the answers. Yes. Sí, se ve. Okay. So we have, it's a quarter Pass. Entonces, yo aquí siempre se la voy a leer contractable. <laughs> it is. So you can say it is or you can say it's. It's a quarter past. Entonces, el artículo aquí es opcional. It's a quarter o pueden poner it's quarter past. It's quarter past. Veamos aquí el primer ejemplo. It's quarter past. What time? The first clock. Eleven quarter past. A quarter past 11, right? It's a quarter past. It's a quarter past 11. 11, excellent. Entonces, miren, vamos mencionando. Recuerden al principio que decíamos primero, cuando queremos mencionar el tiempo que ha pasado una hora, primero empezamos con los minutos. ¿Cuántos minutos han pasado? Entonces, con los cuartos también. Ha pasado un cuarto. Después de las 11. A quarter past 11. It's a quarter to. Ahora veamos otro ejemplo. Uh, el segundo ejemplo que tenemos acá. Second watch. Five. It's a quarter to. Nine. Five. 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 Ah, okay. It's mm -hmm. five forty five. Five forty five or four forty five? Four four. Mm -hmm. It's four forty five. So it means a quarter to quarter to five. Mm -hmm. A quarter to five, yeah. Okay, 
So another possibility for the next one. It's a quarter to five. Oh, yeah, that, that, that is this one, right? So how about it's a quarter past 11? It's a quarter past 11. It's... Mm -hmm. It's 11. It's 11 past. A quarter past. 15. Ajá, como, si, como teníamos las dos formas, ¿de acuerdo? Entonces tenemos esto y tenemos esta. It's a quarter past 11, un cuarto pasado a las 11, o las 11 y 15, it's 11, 15. Ahora la segunda, it's a quarter to 5, un cuarto para las 5, or it's a 4.45, miren, las 4.45, it means a quarter to 5. Ok, so let's see, let's check some more examples. <laughs> okay. So is that clear, guys? So let's see. Um, I'm going to write some numbers and you mention that times, okay? Yo le voy a poner aquí algunos ejemplos. Okay, so guys, please help me. Read the first one. How do how, what is the time? What's the time? The question. What time is it? Okay, what time is it? It's it is eleven o'clock. No, this one. This one. Is it it's it is past twelve, twelve fifteen. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's it's a quarter past twelve. Quarter past it's twelve. Seven. Twelve. Okay, it's a quarter past twelve. How about this one? Number it's two. It's quarter to one. Uh huh. It's a quarter to one. How about this one? A quarter to one. It's. It's a quarter past one. one. Okay, how about this one? It's a quarter to Esta, two. Yeah. It's a quarter to one. Two. It's a quarter to two. Okay. It's a quarter okay. past two. Okay. What else, Adrian? This one, this one. It's two a quarter, quarter two, three. three. Uh -huh. It's a quarter to three. About this one? It's a quarter past three. Okay, and how about this one? It's a quarter to four. It's a quarter to four. Let's see. Let's ask some more uh, questions. Uh, maybe, okay. So let's try with this one. Sí, María Fernanda, start with the first one, A15. It is a quarter past eight. Okay, select some big, uh, uh, some big teams. Well, one big team, María Fernanda, and ask the question. Yeah. Herson. Okay. <laughs> Number two. <laughs> um, it is a quarter... Mm, two, two nine. Okay, yeah, good. Person, select your big team. Juan Carlos. So ask the question. Ahora la pregunta. What time is it, Person? What time is it, Juan Carlos? Number three. Number two, number uh, number three, I guess. Okay. I mean, yeah, number three. Mm 
-hmm. What time is it? Quarter, quarter past night, teacher. Sorry. Quarter past nine. Yeah, it's a quarter past nine. Don't forget it's. It's a quarter past nine. Okay. It's it's a quarter it's a quarter past past nine. Excellent. Okay. Quarter number four. Nine. Juan Carlos, number four. Uh, it's a quarter nine past. Mm, okay. It's a quarter. Un cuarto. Para qué horas? Nine. Two. Two ten. Ajá. Para las nueve, Juan Carlos, o para las diez? La cuatro. La, la, cuatro. la, la cuatro es a las nueve. Ajá. ¿Verdad? La nueve cuarenta y cinco es la que, Ajá, la que la estoy cuatro. diciendo. Ajá, la cuatro. Ok, ok. It's a quarter to... It's a quarter to night. No, ten. Two ten. Ok, got ten, it. Ten. Okay, excellent. Juan Carlos, select somebody. Number five. I select my victim is... <laughs> is uh, Diana. Diana, number five. Pero ahora la pregunta, what time is it, Diana? Ah, perdón. What time is this? It's a quarter past ten. Okay, Diana, select somebody else, please. For number six, Diana. Karen. Karen. What time is it, Karen? Um, say, verdad? Yeah, six. Let's say. Okay. Number six. Is a quarter two. Um, eleven. Mm -hmm. It's a quarter to eleven. Excellent. Uh, Karen, select somebody. Question. Okay. Yeah, um, for number seven. Seven. Uh, what time it is, Maria Fernanda? Seria eight. Seven, 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 seven. Seven. Uh, it is quarter past. Uh, 11. Okay. And the last one? Um, quiero ver. Mm. Kimberly. Kimberly? What time is it, Kimberly? Hello, hello, Kimberly. Number eight. Yeah, number eight. Kimberly Miranda. Hello. I don't know. Uh, leave us a text. Somebody else. Let's see. Volunteer. It's 11. Uh, -huh. It's 11.45. Okay, that's acceptable. Okay, eso está bien. ¿Y cuál es la otra forma, chicos? She said 11.45. Yeah, Jose Maria? It is a quarter to... Uh -huh. 12. To 12. Thanks, Carlita. Okay, so you see, that was not difficult. Let's see. So now, let's continue with the uh, half hours. Seguimos con la media horas. Yeah, tell me. Perdón, teacher, ¿cuál era la otra forma? Ah, la, la otra forma. Ah. Uh -huh. Leerlo en el mismo orden como está. It's 11. Ah, 15. 15. Uh -huh. It's 11 and 16. Uh -huh. It's 11. It's 11 is to 40, uh, 45. 45. 45. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, so now let's check how to mention the half hours. Vamos a ver cómo leer los 30 minutos, 30 minutes past the hour. So half past expression is used when clock shows half hours. Entonces lo utilizamos para hablar de las media horas. So that's the one, right? Um, look at this. We have the time, we have a formal, and we have something less formal, right? So we have, again, verb to be. De nuevo tenemos el... 
it's, luego seguimos con la palabra half, half, listen, half, 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 okay, half. So let's check the following hours for the first one. Entonces ahí tienen ustedes la hora y tienen cómo se escribe. It's half past one. It's half past one. It's half past one. It's half, half past, past one. one. Entonces, ¿qué quiere decir? What time is it? The first one. No, no, no. It's half. It's half past one. Treinta minutos pasan de la una. Sí. And then you have another possibility. It's one thirty. Y la otra forma, una treinta. Y eso sería todo. It's one thirty. Entonces, acá va dividido porque tienen las dos formas. La forma okay. sería esta. It's half past one. It's half past two. It's half past three. Y luego está la otra opción. It's, it's one thirty. It's two thirty. It's three thirty. It's four thirty. It's five thirty. It's six thirty. So that's easier. This is the more fácil. Um, so I suggest you to learn this one. Es solo para las medias horas, teacher. Esto solo para media hora, para media hora, es decir, la 1.30, 2.30, 3.30, 4.30, 7.30, 8.30, todo eso para las medias horas. Okay. okay, so we have, it's half past one, listen and repeat that with me, it's half past one, so we go one by one, okay? So it's half past one. It's half it past one. one. It has past one. Okay, it's half past two. It's half past three. It's half past four. It's half past five. It's half past five. It's it's remember it's 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 Five. Okay, it's half past five. It's half past five. It's half past five. It's half past six. It's half past seven. It's half past seven. It's half past eight. It's half past eight. It's half past nine. It's half past ten. It's half past ten. It's half past eleven. It's half past eleven. It's half past twelve. It's half past twelve. Okay. So you see there you have uh, the full, let's say. So here you have the complete um list of examples with all of the hours. So, aquí tienen la lista con todas las horas. <laughs> so, so you just have to memorize that. So, entonces ahí recuerden nada más que con las medias horas vamos utilizando la palabra half, el verbo to be, luego half, luego la hora, okay? It's half past one, it's half past two, it's half past three, it's half past four, it's half past five, it's half past, past six, right? Let's see, um, Maria Fernanda, I want you, I need you to uh, repeat um, that again, please help me, okay? So the full list, or at least, yeah, the full list. Go ahead. Uh, it is half past half. one. Half. 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 Past one. Okay. So. Yeah, please. Okay. Um. It is half past two. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh play the audio so you can listen to the word. Listen. Half. 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 Okay. No se pronuncia la L o lo half. Solo half. Exacto. Exacto. Es lo mismo como cuando veíamos la palabra could, lo veíamos would. No sé, vimos una anteriormente, creo que era could, 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 de, de podría. Could you tell me the time? Could you tell me the time? Podría decirme la hora. Could you tell me the time? Could you help me? 
could. Could, could you help me? Could you help me? Entonces acá, have. igual, no vamos a pronunciar la L. Half. 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 It's half past it, it's half. Half. Mm -hmm. half. 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 Esta es otra. Tiene dos formas. Una es half y la otra es half. 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 Okay. Half. 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 Yeah. Half. Half. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Continue. Continue, yeah, please. It's half. Half. Past. Half. Half. Yeah. Past three. It's half. Past four. It's half. Past five. It's it half. Past six. It's half. Past seven. It's half. Past eight. It's half past nine. It's half past ten. It's half past eleven. It's half past twelve. Excellent. Good job. Let's see. So we check that again, guys. It's half past one. It's half past two. It's half past three. It's half past four. It's half past five. It's half past six. It's half past seven. It's half past eight. It's half past nine. It's half past 10. It's half past 11. It's half past 12. Ya saben, vete a contar ovejitas más noche, van a estar diciendo la hora. It's half past one. It's half past eleven. <laughs> Let's see. Um, Diana, help me. Diana, the full uh, list. Okay, go ahead. Okay. It's half past one. Half. It's half. It's half past one. It's half past two. It's half past three. It's half past four, it's half past five, it's half past past six, it's half past seven, it's half past eight, it's half past nine, it's half past ten, it's half past eleven, it's half past twelve. Okay, thanks, Diana. Look at this. So check the word past. Okay, and the first one. Vamos aquí la pronunciación de, de esa palabra. Okay, and now you're gonna be used it. You're gonna be using that. Past. Look at this. Past. 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 It's half past ten. It's half past one. It's half past three. Okay. Ahora, la otra. Eso me cuesta un poquito más. Voy a reírse un poquito más. Um, this one. Here. Past. 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 Okay, so maybe I can play that for you. Past. Past. Okay. Past. 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 Okay, past. past, and this is past. So it's this is slightly difference. Okay, so we uh let's see anybody else, maybe Walter, please. Walter, go ahead, Walter. Okay, uh, vamos con it is half. Don't worry, it's yeah. so bad. It is half past one, it is half. Past two, it is half past three, it is half past four, it is half past five, it is half six, it is half past seven, it is half. Es que yo esta la había oído como half, pero dice usted que sin L, vea. Sí, sin L. It is half past eight, it is half 
past nine, it is half past ten, it is half past eleven, it is half past twelve. Okay, thanks. Okay, good job. Uh, Walter, let me see. Vanessa, half. Yeah, half. If the question. Yeah, go ahead. Is half past one, is half, half past two, is half past three, past, it past, it half past, past three, it a uh, half past four, it half past five, past, listen, listen, listen again, sorry, past. 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 Uh -huh. It's, it's S. Past. It's, 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 it have but eight past it it have but nine see past yeah it's it, past. it past. have but ten it has but eleven it has but twelve okay so. okay so we're gonna check the word vamos a checar la palabra okay para Past. Listen, past. 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 Okay, yeah, I say past. Okay, past. Es past. que yo creo que el problema es que es algo trabalengua para nosotros. Yeah, no, I know, but it's mm. normal, yeah, you know. Okay, listen. Past. Yeah, it's like past. Past. past, yeah, past, past. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Volunteer, one more, and then we continue. Uno más y seguimos. Yo. Okay, Sergio, go ahead. It's half past one. It's half past. Two. Past. La T, la T al final. Past. It's past. half. It's half past three. Okay. It's half past four. It's half past five. It's half past six. It's half past seven. It's half past eight. Past. 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 Ah, entonces hay un sonido de la, como pas, primero pas y luego el de la T. Tienen que ir ahí de la colita. El past. Past. It's it half past nine. Okay. It's half past ten. It's half past eleven. It's half past twelve. Okay. Solo que aquí ya se comió el is. It. Solo escuché el it. It's. it's Ajá. It's, okay, lo vamos a hacer todos juntos ahora. Okay, it's half past one. It's half, it's half, half past, past, past one. It's half past two. It's half past two. It's half past three. It's half past three. 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 It's half past three. It's half past four. It's half past five. It's half past six. 
It 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 has past ten. It has past eleven. It has past twelve. Era fácil, era fácil la jate al final, pero cuesta. Ajá, porque hay que sacarla. Past. Sí. Past. 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 Okay. It's past past eleven. Ya le vamos a dar para que Don't worry. So we have another task. <laughs> what is that, teacher? <laughs> okay. Ahora tenemos ejemplos de cómo decir la hora de todas las maneras. Miren. Um, nada más es para que ustedes vayan viendo cómo cómo pueden decir la hora. Vamos al primer ejemplo. Ya lo voy subrayando ahí. O sea menos. menos complicado. Okay, so we have 12.45. 12.45 or 1.15. It's a quarter past one. Una de las formas. It's a quarter past one. A quarter to one. Un cuarto a la una. Okay, la primera. It's 12.45. 12.45. Or it's 1.15. Entonces ahí tienen todas las formas de cómo pueden decir estas dos horas. A quarter past one. A quarter past one. So that's the first one. La primera. A quarter to one. The second. The, the, I mean the, the first one. 12.45. The first one. 1.15. The second one. Again. So let's try with the next one. 1.45. 1.45. So can you identify the time for that one? Identifiquen ahí, 1.45. ¿Cuál de estas es esta? Hay dos opciones. 1.45. La de quarter past two. Ajá. It's a quarter past two. Mm, y... No. La, one, la que es subrayada. 1.45. Ajá. It's 1.45. Perdón, sí, 1.45. Ajá. And the other y... one. Two fixing. No, no, la que está it, subrayada, la que está subrayada. It's a quarter. Quarter to two. It's a quarter to two. It's a quarter to two. Okay, so the next one. This one. Identify the time. Quarter past two. It, it's a it's quarter, quarter past two. two. two fifteen. And two fifteen, okay. The next one. So we have, let me see. This one. It's a quarter past three. three. Quarter past three. Okay, and the other one? It's 3 15. It's 3 15. 15. 15. 15. 15. Okay, how about this one? Otras quarters to four. three. It's to 45. Okay, it's a quarter to three or it's two. 45. Okay, the next one. This one. It's quarter to four. It's a quarter to four. Okay, what else? Four. Four fifteen. 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 Four fifteen. Four fifteen? Four fifteen. Four fifteen. Four fifteen. No. Three. Three. Oh, oh, see, three forty-five. Three, four, 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 four,
Okay, so how about the next one? This is, um, let's see, I'm gonna change the color. Okay, this one. Is quarter past four. Four. Four, 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 four,
Okay, excellent. So now let's continue. And we're gonna be checking some uh, examples. So what do you think about this clock? So I need you to um, have a discussion with your classmates and try to give them the correct times for the following clocks. So ask and answer questions about time. What time is it? So you have to observe the, the clocks and then you provide an answer. So what time is it? What time is it? Clock number one. Clock. What time is it? Uh -huh. It's six o'clock. It's seven o'clock. It's six o'clock. Seven o'clock. Six. Six. Mm -hmm. So that is something that you're going to be doing right now. Okay. So take a picture of it. And another question is, what time do you get to your workplace? And you have to be talking uh, about time using the following clocks. For example, what time is it? So you have to mention all of these times from one to nine, and you can answer using it, right? What time is it? It's six o'clock. It's six o'clock. What time do you get to your workplace? Uh, around six o'clock. Does it mean? ¿A qué hora llegas a tu trabajo? Aquí ustedes pueden, pueden modificarlo. What time do you get to your workplace? What time you, do you get to your house? What time do you get to, I don't know, to the cinema? ¿A qué hora llegas? Uh -huh. And then you, you have to say the time using these clocks from one to nine. Entonces, de, con los nueve lo van a hacer. Uno con la hora y el otro con um, a la hora de llegar que está ya en el trabajo. Or you can modify that. So lo puedo modificar al trabajo o algún otro lugar. Okay. So we have around, alrededor de, around six, around six, around, let me see, uh, let's see, a quarter, uh, 20, 25, around 24 to uh, past 10, around 24 past 10, alrededor de 24 pasadas las 10, or 10, 24. Okay, yeah, is it clear? Take a picture, take a picture. Dámele una foto y pasamos a las salas a practicar. Questions about it? Preguntas? Yo solo vi las y media. Y allá veo como un 47, 48. <laughs> Igual, va haciendo lo mismo. Past. <laughs> va utilizando. Ah, por ejemplo, veamos... Um, Vaya, en ese caso, este, este creo que es el 7. 7. It's 7. Oh, wow. Actually, it's 6. 6. Uh, 50. 50 what? What do you think? What time is it for no, clock number seven? It's six. Fifty-two. Fifty. Fifty-two. Okay. O oh, al revés. ¿Cuántos minutos faltan para las siete? It's eight. Ajá. Uh -huh. It's eight. Two. To seven. To seven. Así. Así lo van haciendo también. Okay, so take a picture, take a picture. Ready? Ready, teacher. So, so, no, yeah. <laughs> okay, so let, let's do it. So you're gonna be working in groups again. So please help your classmates, okay? So be nice. Let's go. Yeah. Me avisan si hay alguien que se quedó sin invitación para uh, resignarlo.
Sí, sí, sí. WhatsApp y Vaya, eh, la primera sería esa, creo que la respondimos ahí, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. It six o'clock. Y sería it is six o'clock. La uno. Sí. sí. Sí, six o'clock, las seis en punto. No, no son las seis en punto. ¿Y qué hora? Sí, en el primero. Sí. Sí. Ah, pues sí, ¿cuál imagen estoy viendo yo, pues? <risa> <risa> Se me perdí. ¿Y dónde están los relojitos, mira, Ari? Todos los relojitos. Ajá. Vaya que no en la primera, son las doce y treinta. No, la seis, la, 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 la Es que la, la agujita pequeña ah, no se marca la hora. Sí, es y la cierto, grande. Estaba viendo, es estaba la, viendo otra. La horaria. Merari, es verdad que tiene ajá. sueño. Sí, <risa> ajá. Sí, es en serio, tengo mucho sueño. <risa> vale, entonces la primera es It's Six ajá, o six clock, o Vaya, ah, vaya. perdida yo. El segundo relojito, vamos a ver, Kimberly. Son las diez. It's... 24. Las 10 y 24 serían... It's... <ríe> Ay, mire que... Vamos a ver, voy a ver los ejemplos. Sería... Yo creo que... It's ahí... a quarter. Ah, oh, no. It's no. a... Three... Ahí se puede leer cómo va. Ahí se puede leer cómo va, sí, en orden. ¿Cómo, cómo dijo Kimberly? <ríe> Mamá. It's a 32, tú. <ríe> ¿Ah? <ríe> Menos Vaya. mal que yo soy la que <ríe> tengo sueño. Este, <ríe> bueno. este, Ajá. 24. Creo yo que así se tendría que leer porque son sí, 24, sí, 20, no han pasado 24. un cuarto. Ajá, 24. 24, ¿verdad? Sí. En la 5 sería it. Uh, son la 1. 1. 38. Juan. Yo no tengo. No, ustedes tocó, tienen la foto de la. Ah, no sé, aquí está. Ah, no, pero esta es la Por ejemplo, dos y media, tres y media. Y si estamos en el seis, sería como, por ejemplo, las cinco y, uh -huh. y tres, por ejemplo. No podría ser half. Sí, 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 tiene razón. Ajá, porque half. Solamente lo tenemos que utilizar como las y media, tres y media, cuatro y media, cinco y media. Media hora. Ajá, en medias horas. Entonces sería. Entonces sería. It's five. It's five. Ay, que no veo bien. Pero una que no me quiere que no me no no me no me no me Ajá, ajá. Serían como las cinco y dos. Ay, tú. Ay, tú. Yo digo que sí. 
Sí, sí. Acuérdense que hay varias formas de decirlo. De decirlo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ahora el 7 dice que es... Y es a las 7. <risa> Sería... Eh... De... Ajá, uh -huh. y five forty seven, sí. Vamos por la otra. Eh, uh -huh. La otra son unas tres y veinticuatro. Veinticuatro, veinticuatro, cuatro, 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 Twenty-four past three. Y la otra es entonces twenty-four. No, sí. O lo están solo la misma forma. ajá yo solo a una le he puesto la de de las la dos formas ajá la segunda <ríe> quiero ver esta sería ajá it's three sí La otra es la una y la una treinta y ocho. Sí, treinta y ocho. It's it's one. Ay. 
इसको हम चढ़े यही él decide yo digo que dos yo creo que hacen tres it's three past it's it's three past five cinco era it's it's three it's three three past three. five five past five ay no sé cómo se escribe three e t h r e e entonces así sería it's three past five Sí, it's three past five. La otra es <ríe> copiar. Vaya, el, el, otro, el otro es el ejemplo que dio la teacher, ¿verdad? que faltaban para eso. Es lo de yo. Ocho. It's eight to seven. ¿Cuál vamos a poner? Ahí elija. Siguiente. Serían it's. 52. Pu pueden ser, puede ser eh, it's, eh, it's, it's 658. It's 8 to 7. Ajá. It's 8 to 7. Dejamos eso. ¿Cómo? Sí. ¿Cómo? It's 8 to 7. Faltan para. Faltan ocho para las siete. Ajá, it's eight to seven. Pero aquí me faltan más. No, no faltan ocho. A mí me faltan doce para las ocho. Está mal, es Renodia. Sí, ocho, ocho, ocho creo yo que parecen aquí. No, hombre. Cincuenta y dos, hombre. ¿Eh? ¿Ah? Entonces sí, Ajá. ocho faltan. Entonces. Ah, sí, 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 sí. Pero tiene malo el reloj. Ah, no, por eso llega tarde al trabajo. A mí aquí me van pasando ya los números. Este sí me confundí porque aquí no. Entonces aquí quedamos con, con eh, ir y hey, tu, tu, tu qué? Y tu seven. Y hey, tu seven, así lo vamos a dejar. Seven. Sí. Ok. It. Y esta es bien. It's eight, no, one, two, two, the, the two. Aquí por un minuto no es un, la media hora. Ajá, por un minuto no utilizamos la Para que usemos el half. <ríe> bueno, entonces el otro sería el, el octavo, number eight. Es reloj analógico, aunque está en español, suda uno cuando le piden la hora. Quiero ver, quiero ver. Me haya la hora, uno. ¿Y aquí sería como la anterior o, o le ponemos el, el pas? Hagamos otra. Este, no, eh, antes, creo yo, de. Aquí sería It Story One. No. No, aquí es una 12 y 31. Acuérdense que antes de, antes de 30 es paz. Y Por después eso. de 30 es tú. Por eso. Sería, sería tú. O lo, o lo ponemos, este, it's 12, eh, 31. It, uh, 31. Pero entonces de la otra quedaría, it's 32. 32. 12. Ajá. Ajá, de la otra forma quería It's It, when, when Sorry Sorry One no, ah, no, ah, no, aquí faltan Aquí faltan Este Faltan 29 para la una Ah, entonces es que aquí no se dicen los minutos Que, que tenemos, ¿verdad? No, se dice It's Los minutos que faltan 20, It's 20, 29 eh, 29 
to to to, uh, to one to one. Uh -huh. Así lo voy a dejar. Se puede hacer así o se puede hacer de la otra forma. Vean. It's, entonces sería it's, it's 21. No es 29. 29, perdón. Uh -huh. It's 29. To one. To one. It's 29 to one. Uh -huh. Ajá. Ahora um, son las nueve. Aquí podríamos usar el pas. Tres. Uh -huh. It's... It's three. Past night. It's three past night. Sí. Past night. Bye. <laughs> you finished? Casi, casi. Casi, casi. Va, yo, pre yo pregunto. Y prim ah, okay. Ahorita va Yolanda. Va. La pregunta Yola es de What Time It Is, ¿verdad? Ajá, sí. Yolanda, What Time It Is. Uh, la primera. Sí, la, la primera fila le toca a usted. Okay. La, la uno, dos y tres. It's 20. No, it's 6 o'clock. Ok. Ahora la segunda. Pero pregúnteme, what time is it? Ah, what, <laughs> what time is it number two? <laughs> yeah, sí, sí. Ten. It's, it's ten. Uh, past 24. Okay. What time is it number three, please? Uh, it. It. Uh, 14. Four. 14. Six, two, six. Well. No, six. Sí. Espérame. Corríjame. Sí. sí, sí, está bien. Ok, yo le voy Bye. a presentar a la compañera entonces. Dele, dele. Ajá, what I need it, eh, number four. Yo respondo. Uh -huh. Ok, it's three past 24 or it's 24. Ok, what I need it, eh, number five. It's one thirty eight or it's twenty two two two. Uh, two two. What time is it? Uh, number six. Six. It's five past three or it's five three. Okay. Me pregunta el compañero. Okay. What time it is? Number seven. Number seven. Uh, it is five eleven. Or it is. Espérame que se me apagó esta cosa. It is. Um, Checa lo más difícil me dejaron a mí. <laughs> Quiero ver cuánto falta para las once. Es que lo, en los relojes de aguja no me las puede usted. Quiero ver. Faltan como 10, 11, 12. Ah, pues, it is eh, 12 to 7. Esa sería la otra forma. 8. Vaya, déme con la 8. What time it is? Number 8. It is. Eh, 12, 31, 31, or it is 29, 2, 1. Okay, sorry. What time it is, number 9? 9. It is uh, 9, 3, or it is 
nine past three. Yeah. Vale. Ahora esto otro que dijo sobre Aaron. Que sí. Ahí, ahí está en el treinta y ocho. Yo lo puse como 22, no 24. It's 22, 2. It's 22, 2, 2. Así sería. Bien to raro. Get to eight. Para las dos. Pero en cuál? En las cinco. Ay, sí, no había visto el palito chiquito. Ah, es que la horaria está en la, en, entre medio del 1 y el 2. Del 1 al 2. Ajá, sería 22 a las 2. Ajá. Pero 22, ¿por qué sí? Porque es prácticamente está agarrando 38 minutos. Voy a 22 minutos faltarían para las 2. 22, 22, 22. Pero si es antes del 8 y antes del 8 es 20. ¿Cómo así? Vaya, en el 8 son... Ah, se completa los 20 40. A las, a las, Ajá, 20, a las 20 a las, a las Pero 2. Pero el palito está antes del 8, entonces no sería... Por eso serían 20. 22. No. Porque si pasara los 8 serían menos 20. ¿Sí o no? Vaya, a 38, no resta 80. a las 2. No, vaya, a 38, resta 60. Son 22. ¿Sí o no? ¿Contador ahí? <risa> sí. ¿Cierto, verdad? Sí, 22. 22. Uh -huh. Entonces sería. Yes. 22. Bueno, yo así lo había puesto. No sé si les he modificado algo a ustedes. Si no, igual le preguntamos a la teacher. Pero... Sí, pues. En las sí. seis. En la 6, ¿cómo lo habían puesto? Ahí lo habían puesto en terz. Espérame, ¿qué es de aquí? ¿Qué es de me equivoqué? Sí, aquí me equivoqué ya. Porque sería... Or... Hello, hello, guys. Welcome back. So we're going to continue with the rest of the activities. So I'm gonna be asking some of you, okay? So let's see, so here we have. Okay, let's see. Uh, we need volunteers. Well, no, maybe some, yeah, volunteers to read some of the dialogues, some of the clocks. It's six o'clock. Uh -huh, what time is six uh, uh, for the first one? Six o'clock. Six o'clock. About, about the second one. What time is it for the second clock? Selección alguno ahí, algún compañero. Yeah, o yo. okay. <laughs> eh, Vanessa, what time is it? El segundo, ¿verdad? El, yeah, the second one. Number two. Number two. Uy, no la hice. Uy. Okay. Anybody who Hombre, no. That? Son las que si la hice. It's 23 para 10 y 24. Ajá. It's 10, 24. Ok, good. Vanessa, select somebody else and uh, somebody else and ask the time. What time is it? Four o'clock okay. number three. Yeah. What time mm, it's is it um, Walter? Uh, it is five 
46 or it is oh faltan cuánto 14 it is 8 eh, no faltan 13 sí, 14. 14. Sí, 14. It is 14 to 6. Ok. Continue. Select somebody else for the next okay, one. Ok. Vamos con Diana. What time it is, Diana? Es la... La 4. It's uh, 24 past 3. Okay, yeah, good. Continue, Diana. Select some, some, uh, select one person, please, or number five. Jacqueline. Okay. What time is it? Number five, Diana. Jacqueline, hello, hello, Jacqueline. Do you have number five? Sí. Sorry, no he aprendido el micrófono. Okay, no problem. Is 22. Bueno, nosotras le hicimos, ¿verdad? Is 22, two. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it sounds funny. Yeah. Okay, uh, Jacqueline, select somebody else. Ask, ask question uh, okay. again. What time is it? For number six. What time is it, Herson? Um, it is five or two. Mm -hmm. Five or oh, two. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, continue. Um, what time is it, Yolanda? The number? No. Eleven. Eleven. Uh, seven, 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 number seven. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's... It um eight minutes. Uh-huh. It's uh twenty. Twenty to seven. Twenty to seven. Look at this. Mm -hmm. How many minutes to, to seven? ¿Cuántos minutos faltan para las siete? Chequen ahí nuevamente el conteo ahí. Aquí, aquí. Ocho. Eight. Ajá. Eight. Ocho. Eight. Ah, eight. Ajá, es este, esa. Esa ah, es la hand, esa es la chiquita. La mija, esa es la horaria. A mí, okay, a mí, entonces la, sería... Al revés, la horaria y la... Mira, Ajá. Mira. Entonces sería it... Uh, eight. Eight to, to, to seven. Ok, mm -hmm. excelente. Continue. Uh, ask the question to somebody else. Or clock number eight. ¿Quién falta? Mm, bastante. Diana. Diana. No, Diana ya pasó. Creo eh, que... Kimberly. 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 Okay. What time is it, Kimberly? Number eight. It's 22, 9 to 1. Mm. 20. Uh, 29 to 1. 29 to 1. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Excellent, excellent. Excellent, good job. <laughs> Thanks for being. Okay, continue. Number 9. Ask the question, Kimberly. Pregúntale a alguien más, Kimberly. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> What time is it in Carla? Carlita? Carlita, hello, hello. Ajá. Me escuchan. 
Yeah. It's nine past three. Nine past three. Mm, number nine. La nueve. El reloj número nueve. Al revés. Nine past nine. Ajá. Uh -huh. Es al revés. Three, three, three minutes. Primero los minutos que han pasado. Okay, it's three past nine. Okay, excellent. Okay, good job. So now we're going to have a discussion. We're going to continue with another one because we need more time. So we're going to continue with the second part. So we're going to have a conver short conversation on the following questions. So when do you wake up in the morning? So tell me the time. So when do you wake up in the morning? Time. Example, I wake up at... So can you mention the time? So when do you wake up in the morning? Guys, anybody, you can open your microphones. I'll answer the question. When do you wake up in the mornings? When do you wake up when in the morning? When do you wake up in the morning? Okay. I wake up five. At five. Five a.m. Five a.m. Okay. Five a.m. Good. So second question, what is the first? Thing you do after you wake up. Yes. What do you do? Uh, what is the first thing you do after you wake up? Lo primero que hacen después de levantarse. Take a shower. Uh -huh. I okay. Take take a a shower. Shower. I what take time? What time do you take a shower? Uh, what time? Five. At. Ten a.m. Ten a.m. I. Ten. By 10 minutes. By 20 p.m. Okay. The, uh, the next one. What do you usually eat and drink for breakfast? 6 30. Six. Okay, but what do you eat? So you eat at 6 30. But what do you eat and drink? For example, I eat pupusas and chocolate. What time? Six. 30 or half past 6 p.m. Okay, let's see. What time do you eat lunch, guys? Anybody? What time do you eat lunch? It's 12. I eat lunch at? I eat lunch at 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Okay, 12 o'clock. Do you eat dinner? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Okay, Poquito. so wh what time? What time? Just in the Seven. Sorry. Seven thirty, half past seven, right? Half past seven. Yes, I eat dinner. Okay. Uh, what do you do in the evening? Tell me uh, some activities that you do in the evening. What do you do in the evening? Guessing. No, no, yes, no, 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 What do you do in the evening? Tell me. Plus the English. Okay. okay. I attend my English class. Okay. What else? Okay. And my cell phone. Uh-huh, and I? I brush my teeth. Okay, brush. Brush my brush. teeth. Brush, brush my teeth. teeth. Ah, okay, let's see. When do you usually go to bed? What time? What time do you go to bed? Ayer, de, está hablando de la hora. Uh-huh. 12 p.m. I go to bed. I at... go to bed at 10, sorry. Okay. Okay, for half past 10, right? So when do you wake up? Oh, yeah, that's the same question. Um, so we're going to discuss these seven questions in the groups. You're going to be working with uh, some more people. And I need you to add the times that you do each of these activities. Lo que quiero que hagan es que vayan agregando la hora en la que hacen ustedes estas actividades. For example, when do you wake up in the morning? I wake up at 5 a.m. Uh, what is the first thing you do after you wake up? I take a shower at 5.20 a.m. or at, uh, at 20 past 5 a.m. 
what do you usually eat and drink for breakfast? I eat pupusas and chocolate at seven o'clock, for example. Do you, what time do you eat lunch? I eat lunch at noon, at mid, uh, midday, or uh, eat lunch at 12 o'clock, right? So you do you eat dinner? Yes, I eat dinner at 7.30 p.m. before my English class. What do you do in the evening? I attend my English class and I brush my teeth. When do you usually go to bed? I go to bed at half past 10 p.m. Ok, entonces aquí nos están preguntando a qué horas hacemos algunas de las actividades. Para hablar de las horas, siempre vamos poniendo ahí el at en este caso. Me levanto a las 5. Ok, um, me baño a las 5.20. Desayuno a las 7.30 de la mañana. Almuerzo a las 12 en punto. No voy a dormir a las eh, 10.30. ¿okay? Entonces vamos ubicando la preposición at para eh, indicar el tiempo en que se realiza esa actividad. Entonces aquí ya no es what time is it. Cuando me están preguntando la hora, ya sabemos cómo se responde. It is 7 o'clock. Pero acá nos están preguntando a qué horas hacemos estas actividades en particular. Entonces ahí Exacto. vamos utilizando preposición at. Para eh, horas específicas. Díganme. The first seven questions. Ah, yeah. Las mismas, de, las de abajo son las mismas. So, ah, okay. we're okay. going to discuss just the seven questions. Okay. okay. So, let's do it. Uh, you're going to have five minutes to discuss that. Okay. And let me see. Okay. Perfect. Think of you after Ahí, you wake up. Diana. Yeah. Ahí podría usar el quarter. Ajá, también. Sería el quarter. a quarter past Pero seven. el quarter no será solo para dar la hora. También se puede utilizar en oh, el cuarto. Yo creo que sí. A las bueno. siete y cuarto. 
Bueno, démosle la segunda. What is the first thing you do after you wake up? Fidel. ¿Qué significaba eso? ¿Qué es lo primero que haces al levantarte? O después de levantarte. Ah, sería, the first I go, go to bath. Then I take the shower. And also I brush my teeth. Okay. And that's all. Well, Diana, what is the first thing you do after you wake up? Uh, I check my cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> Está bien, vaya, pregúnteme a alguien. Pregúnteme. No oí, pero bueno. Ahí está Carlita. Uh, hello, Carlita. Hola. Hey, Carlita. What is the first thing you do after you wake up? I take a shower at 6 o'clock. Ah, bueno, la hora está bien. Uh, yo lo primero que hago es, I, ¿cómo se llama? I go to the bathroom, I, I take a shower. <laughs> hey, es cierto. I brush my teeth, solo eso. Hello, hello, guys. Yeah. ¿Cómo le va? Hello. Acá estamos ahorita, teacher. So just think about your ideas. Come on. Think about some possible answers. So discuss them, because we have just some minutes. So start discussing. Empiecen a discutir, los chicos. Okay. Okay. Bye. ¿Quién pregunta? Okay. When do you get up, get up in the morning? Me. When do you wake up, Teria? In the morning. Uh -huh. In the morning. When do I you wake? I wake. I I wake up at seven a.m. I wake up uh I wake up at 5 p.m. Patty, you turn. Karen? <laughs> Dígalo, tiene que decirlo. <laughs> English class. I game play with with children. Y la siete dice, when do you usually go to bed? I go to bed um, 10.30 p.m. Yeah, I, I go to bed at uh, around 10.30 eh, PM. Y Cher, David se tuvo que ir. David. Sí, lo que pasa es de que creo que un familiar que él tiene ahí ha de tener quizás demencia, entonces él lo cuida. Okay. Entonces creo que le había agarrado ahorita crisis. Voy, voy a hablar con él entonces. Y ahí propuso en el chat. Sí, le costó porque estaba contestando, pero ya después ya ahí lo puso. Ah, ok. Vamos a checar entonces. Gracias, Mari. Vaya. Hello, Mari. Mari. <ríe> Maffer. Le Mari. Sí, Mari. No, ticha, no me gusta. <ríe> ¿Cómo le, how do you like to be called? ¿Cómo le gusta que le llamen? Eh, Mari Fernanda, Fer. Es más corto. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's a good name. Okay. I see. 
Karen. Ok, entonces sería question three. Three. Yes. What do you usually eat and drink for breakfast? Breakfast. Um, I eat a smoothie de... Eh, teacher, una consulta. Uh -huh. ¿Qué, ¿Qué es lo que tomo? Dice. Ave, dice avena. Avena, ¿cómo se dice? Oatmeal. Um. Ajá, es que yo lo busqué, pero no, no. No sé cómo se pronuncia. Wick. 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 ¿Cuál encontró? Eh, ya le digo, Juan. La que usted me dijo primera. Oatmeal. 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 Uh -huh. La que va a hacer, la voy a poner acá para que la escuche. Oat. 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 Ajá, Oat. Ajá es que ese es otro sustantivo. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Entonces, I eat a smoothie de oat, oat with milk. Oat. Ajá, pero no es una O, es oat. It's oat. 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 Eggs uh, with frijoles, se me olvidó cómo se eggs, dice. Bean. Bean. Eggs. Eggs with beans. Ah, ok. Fried beans. Fried beans. Fried beans. Uh -huh. Fried beans. Uh, in coffee. And you drink coffee. Yeah, good. Nice. I uh, love that, of course. Yeah. So I think that's my favorite, um, let's say, <clears throat> part of the day and breakfast. <laughs> Sí, es el mejor del día, creo. Que lo coffee. Yeah. You like coffee? I, I like I coffee. don't like coffee. No? Oh. no? Why not? How old are you? <laughs> How old are you, Hershey? Uh, ¿Dónde es usted que no le gusta el café? 29. 29. Yeah, I'm 29, too. Um, yeah, this year I have started uh, drinking coffee. Este año empezó la adicción. <laughs> <risa> Así que creo que está cerca, Gerson. Ya, ya casi. <risa> ya la reo. <risa> ya va a dejar la vena. De, después de eh. los 30. <risa> Ay, piso. <risa> ok, let's go back. Uh, vamos a regresar, chicos. Ok. Bueno, aprendí, a ver, vamos. <risa> vamos. A ver, después se puede en serio. <risa> Silencio total. Hey, no, no, ahí no, no estén callados. ¿Qué pasa? Está ah. regañado. <laughs> ok, so let's pass attendance list. Adriana, Lizeth, Chávez, López. Ya son las 10, Sergio. Estamos así. <laughs> Ana Coralia Flores de Hernández. She left. César Hernández Portillo Díaz. Dayana Elizabeth Ramírez Arevalo. Aquí. Dayana. 
Hello. Aquí. Hola. Hello. Ok. Diana Verónica Cisneros Toledo. Hola, me dice. Ok. Diana Verónica Cisneros Toledo. Diana. No me acuerdo que me han dado. Me dan imágenes. Ni hay problema. Diego Alberto Quintanilla Morales. Edwin Alexander Argote López. Edwin. Elsie Arely Ruiz Meléndez. Fidel Antonio Villatorro Hernández. Yo vi que él sí puso algo en el grupo. Ok. Ok, I'm going to check that. Gerson Oswaldo Dera Santana. Present teacher. Gloria Elizabeth Contreras Argueta. Jacqueline Xiomara Araujo de Sura. Present. Thanks, Jacqueline. José David Zúñiga Padilla. <coughs> José David. Ah, José María Mejía Espinosa. Presente, teacher. Juan Carlos Quevedo Alfaro. Present, teacher. Karen Gemina Membreño. Thanks, Juan Carlos. Karen Gemina Membreño. Present. Present. Ok, vamos a checar ese micrófono, Karen. Híjole. Sí. No sé si son los audífonos. Pero le, le... Como que está ronroneando. Robot. Ah. Tengo miedo, tengo miedo. Tengo miedo. No, son los efectos. Los efectos. Mucho se lo acerca, mucho se lo acerca. Ahí le da risa. No, pero lo, hay que checarlo, hay que checarlo. Carla Nayeli Machado Ramos. Present. Kimberly Nayeli Miranda Díaz. Present. María Fernanda Morán Rives. Present. Thanks. Uh, Merari Andrea Sánchez Facundo. Merari. Ok. Sergio David Leiva Pereira. Present, teacher. Vanessa Guadalupe Santos Girón. Present, teacher. Thanks. Walter Amilcar Ramírez Molina. Present. Thanks. Yolanda Pérez de Sánchez. Present, teacher. Thanks, Yolanda. Okay, guys. So that's all for today. We'll see you in our next class tomorrow, okay? So have a great night. Bye-bye. Nos vayan a molestar por la foto que les mandé al grupo. ¿Qué nos mandó? Ahí riéndose, riéndose todos. No estamos riendo juntos. Qué río, qué, qué gesto va a sentir mal Karen, mire. No, no, no. Y no, Sergio, salí de la risa. Good night, good night. Bye bye, guys. See you tomorrow, see you tomorrow. See you, bye -bye. See you bye -bye. next class. Yeah, tomorrow. Bye bye, guys. <laughs>